still in the state of Kuwait, the Gulf BIM and Digital Contru Construction rather, Conference and Expo launched today with local, regional and global participation. The conference plays a key role in increasing societal awareness and emphasizing the substantial advantages of employing technology as a critical approach to completing construction projects and provide a more transparent design and process in a shorter time frame. More on that with Hadil Fahad. The Gulf BIM and Digital Construction has begun, presenting regional and international developments in the field of digital construction. The event aims to discuss and derive conclusions and recommendations that amplify the role of digital construction in supporting Kuwait's vision for 2035. Well, for this type of conference, we attracted the industry, and this is good. Companies like Siemens, Autodesk, when they are on board and, and the agenda, for the Tuesday and Wednesday, they are with us. They are doing presentations for the public in Kuwait and in front of all those professional engineers. The conference brings together a select group of academics and experts from local, Gulf and global backgrounds in both industrial and academic domains. It focuses on examining the digitization of facility and infrastructure management, as well as adopting digital designs for buildings and structures. Just we try to bridging the gap between industry and the academy. In Turner International, as a project management consultant, we are providing the services to manage the project through the life cycle from uh, initiation phase till construction and operation phase. Hosting this type of a scientific conference is deemed a significant contribution to serving both the community and Kuwait. Moreover, it holds the distinction of being the first of its kind in the country. So the conference will feature workshops to share experiences from local Gulf and international academic experts, along with discussions on recommendations in preparation for their submission to relevant authorities. For Kuwait English News, Hadil Fahad.